Hi guys and welcome back to our YouTube channel and today you catch us on another travel, travel day. day. Today we are off on our travels. We are heading to Malta. Yeah, we've never been to Malta, have no, we? No, never been. No. We are off on a big family holiday. Yeah. So there's 12 of us going. We're going with Tom's parents, Tom's brother, Tom's sister, her husband and their children. Yeah. So there's a yeah. fair few of us. There's a big group of us come, uh, going. You would have seen my mum and dad on our previous trips. If you haven't watched our previous trips, um, we did go with them to Tenerife, oh, yes. didn't we? Yeah, if you haven't watched our yeah. Tenerife vlogs, um, we went to Tenerife with Tom's mum and dad a, yeah, a while so you, back. Yeah, so you would have seen them. They, they didn't talk anything on camera, no. but yeah, they, they did come on that trip with us, so you would have seen them. Um, so yeah, like Jess says, we're going with them, uh, my brother, my sister, her partner, her husband, and their five kids. So we're going to bring you guys along like we do on all our travels now. Yeah, so it will be, if going back to the Tenerife vlogs, if you watch those, it was in two parts. So mm. similar with that, we're not gonna do a daily vlog um, like we do when we go to Florida. We are going no. to split it up like we did when we went to Tenerife. Again, we're gonna take you with us. We're gonna show you as much as we can. Yeah. But we're gonna be with Tom's family. That's the priority. Yeah. We're going on a family holiday. But if we do anything, we'll show you. Obviously, we'll show you the hotel and things like that. Um, so it'll either be split up into two, three, four. We're not yeah. really sure how it many. Could, it might even be one big vlog. Might we don't be one know big yet. Vlog. We'll We're see. not sure yet. Yeah, we'll see what see we. See how much content we get. Yeah, of course. Um, We've got a few things planned, which we will obviously again bring you along with. There's yeah. a few things we haven't planned that we will probably plan when we are there. Yeah. So we'll let you know what those are. We're staying in St. Paul's Bay, yep. um, which again, we've never been to Malta, so we're not too sure what that area is like, so it's, it's new for us. So we know there's explore. a Starbucks nearby. Yeah, we do, yeah. So we're gonna explore around there, and we're staying at the Dolman Hotel. Dolman, yeah. So it's gonna be really nice. Really it's really nice. Yeah, it looks incredible. We'll do a hotel tour like we normally do, room tours, yeah. etc. But yeah, we are just waiting to be picked up yep. on the party bus. It's not a yeah. party bus, but... <laughs> Yeah, we've got a big uh, bus taking us down to Stansted, yep, uh, again with Tenerife. Stansted. We flew from Stansted, it's about 45 minutes from where we live, so it's not too far. So we're going to jump in there when it arrives. We'll show you a little bit of the trip down there. But next time we speak, uh, it will probably be at the airport. At the airport. Yeah, so we'll pick it up there. And then as we go throughout the journey, obviously we'll let you know what we are doing, uh, what we're eating and stuff like that. <laughs> what we're eating, so, the most important. <laughs> yeah, so we might see you, we might talk on the way down, we're not too sure yet. Uh, but if we don't see you then, we will see you at the airport. So while we're waiting for the bus, we thought we'd do an outfit of the day. So we're back. Jess? A travel outfit of the day. So start at the feet. Got these uh, Air Force Ones. Sick. They do look naughty then. They are naughty. Um, I've got Nike socks. Adenola trousers. Adenola t-shirt. Adenola jumper. Head to foot in Adenola as always. Yeah, it is comfy that, isn't it? Yep. Comfy attire for the trip. It is, yes. Looking forward to it. So we're just going to wait here now for the bus and then show you guys the journey down. So we have made it through security. 
really breezy, really yeah. quiet in here. Actually. That was uh, the quietest I've actually ever seen it. Uh, that was that was so good. Actually, nearly um, well, I got told off a little bit because I was filming yeah. just before we went into departures. Film the departure sign, and yeah. some man came running up to tell me to delete that off your camera. Yeah, but it's all a learning curve. That, so. It's all a learning curve. I've never done Tips. it before, so don't film the departure sign. Yeah, so we're actually coming to Spoons now. Yeah, gonna grab a quick drink with the family. Um, we have picked up a few items out of boots and stuff like that. Just, just to tide us over, time. yeah, tide us over the flight. I don't think we've said that we're flying with Jet 2. No. Our flight's so. at 10 to 3 and it is currently just gone 1 o'clock. Mm. So we've got a little little bit of time before we start boarding. So we thought we'd come for a quick drink. Yeah. Have a bit of a snack because we're all a bit hungry. Yeah, just see how, see how that is. And then, yeah, once we uh, get our boarding um, gate, yeah, we'll head down there. And then uh, we'll obviously just bring you guys along like we, like we always do. So the first drink of the holiday is in. Obviously we do love a Guinness. This will be my drinking buddy for the next week. If he decides he can keep up. So the flight meal has come out. I have gone for the Piri Piri chicken uh, with rice. So as you can see, it actually looks okay. And then we also have in here some crackers, cheese spread, and a chocolate mousse. So Jess has gone for the same thing. That's looking all right. So all done with the in-flight meal. I went for the Piri Piri chicken and it was actually all right. It wasn't too bad at all. And all meals come with a hot drink so I've just gone for a coffee so has Jess the it never leaves us no it never leaves us but that, that was actually okay that meal so I think we're about 45 minutes into the flight now so we'll pick this up uh, a bit later on the flight So guys, we have finally arrived. We made it to Malta. Yeah, we did. I think the flight was about three and a half hours. Three, um, I think it was three hours 15, but we were actually yeah. pretty late taking off. Miller take off at 2.50, didn't take off yeah. till half three. Yeah, we were a little bit delayed, so, but delayed. it was a great flight actually. I've never flown with um, with Jet2 yeah, and, no, and Jet they were, they were fantastic. Yeah. And, um, we chose in-flight meals. You would have seen them, but we chose in-flight meals just because yeah. there was, there's 12 of us. Um, yeah. You never know if you're going to get any food in the airport, if there's going to be enough seating for nah. 12 of you, etc. So, so obviously we you have we'll to get in-flight meals because it's a bit easier. Yeah, it's just actually, to... it was quite decent. Yeah, it's just to make sure that we do have something when we're yeah. on there. But yeah, no, they were absolutely lovely. And the staff were really nice. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it was just a really pleasant flight, wasn't it? And with the meal, actually, you got a... Uh, water or a tea or coffee, yeah. which is good included. So yeah. Yeah, we both had a coffee, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so yeah. that was nice. Decent so flight. we are just going to wait for our bags now, and then yeah. as soon as our bags have landed, we are going to jump on the transfers. I can't remember what the transfers. We've got are. a private transfer. I think we've got, yeah. yeah. My dad sorted all this out, He's so I have no idea yeah. what we're doing. Um, so no, we have um, got a private transfer. I know that much. Yeah, so we uh, we're going to jump on there as soon as we've got our bags, and then um, head to the hotel. The time is. Um, my watch is dead. Yeah, um, the time is. <laughs> it's now 10 to 8, and that's so here. Late. So, yeah. you know, we are an hour ahead here than we were back in the UK. Yeah. So, um, yeah. I don't I'm think sure. we'll probably be at the hotel till about 9 pm. Nah, and it might well catch up with us shortly, but yeah, we'll bring you along anyway, and we'll show you the hotel once we're there.
okay so i am here with the room tour so come in the door and then you've got um the wardrobes here got quite a lot of wardrobe space actually which is good so in this one here you've got a little bit of hanging space a little bit of shelf space and you've got a safe there which is really good and some shelf space there and then over here you've got a full wardrobe wow look at the size of that that is huge it's like a full wardrobe wow okay that is brilliant and loads of hangers as well which is great i always find in hotels you never get enough hangers and then to the side here you've just got some um complimentary water which is good and then my favorite thing of all time you've got tea and coffee making facilities this i love in a hotel they took them all out for covid years ago um and i'm so glad they've got some because i love a cup of tea i'm gonna have a cup of tea in a minute um and then you've got a little fridge here oh, it's only small but yeah serviceable looks all right and then back on ourselves so this is the this is the door the main door and then in here you've got this huge oops, huge bathroom i mean look at the size of that shower that's amazing lovely standard toilet sink hello i'm very tired it's late oh, it's been a long day but we're here and yeah, you've got um, little complimentary bits and pieces. You've got a shower cap. Oh, they're all shower caps. And then you've got some shower gel and shampoo and some soap, which is really good. But the sign, the light up mirror, amazing. Come back a bit. Look, huge. How cool is that? I love it. It's very nice here from what we've seen so far. So then just back through here, nice full length mirror a couple of seats there and a table and over here you've got a desk a telly and then you've just got some more storage which is good and then uh, you've got tom and the beds just two singles pushed together which is perfectly adequate for us which is nice and then we have got a balcony i mean obviously it's dark now so you can't really see a lot but i'm assuming it um overlooks the pool and i'm assuming that's the sea there um i'll show you more when it's lighter but yeah really happy with this it's really nice what do you think thomas yeah it's nice isn't it yeah it'd be nice to see it in the morning yeah it'd be nice to see it when it's light um and when it's not so tired late and we're not so tired um, but yeah nice one yeah so that is the room tour complete thanks jess you're welcome yeah so we've obviously come up to the room now but when we first arrived here they did say the restaurant was still open and we are all inclusive we may not yeah. have mentioned that so they said the restaurant was still open even though we got here i think it was um no. past past sort of half nine wasn't it no it was earlier than that i think the restaurant Before closed at quarter past nine and i think we got here at nine so we yeah. had 15 minutes all right yeah so i was slightly out but um <laughs> i think that was the time yeah it, might, it was around that anyway anyway it was it was kind of fine so we went into the restaurant we had some food uh this the spread wasn't that wide to be fair i think it's because it is the end of the night yeah. so we do plan on running everyone through all of that or obviously you guys through that tomorrow and we will run you through the breakfast but it was all right wasn't it yeah i mean for what there was tonight it was fine for, for you know fine yeah um i think oh hopefully there'll be more earlier on in the night i think it was last knockings like we said last 15 minutes yeah. so there wasn't a lot yeah. of selection but i'm sure it will be much better tomorrow yeah but all of checking was fine wasn't it yeah, yeah so we got here lovely, checked room's in lovely. room's lovely um and then we had to had dinner like we said and then they did hold our bags in reception so yeah, that we could nice just come up um so we could bring them up after after having dinner because obviously it was a bit of a rush so then we got a hold of our bags after dinner come up here obviously just just on the room tour yeah. and now it is quite late so it we are going to um 
Uh, it is. It's now half ten. Half ten, yeah. kids. So we are going to oh, end tired. this vlog here, yep. but we will pick it up in the morning. So again, like we said earlier, we're not sure how many vlogs this is going to be in. It no. could be in one long vlog. It could be split into two, or two, three, or four. We don't know. So just depends what we get up to, the amount of content we get. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. Priority is spending do. time with family. That's what we're here for. Yeah. But if we can show you what we get up to, I'm sure we'll do some, yeah. some bits and pieces. Um, Obviously, we've done the room tour in here now. We do want to do the breakfast. We'll do the um, breakfast, the food, the dinner. Yeah, because we're all inclusive. We'll do yeah. lunch as well. We'll snacks. walk you through that. We'll walk you through the snacks. Uh, we'll take you through the hotel as well. We've actually just had a brief walk around the hotel. Yeah. And it is huge. It's huge. So, uh, we'll yeah, and my we'll mum and dad's room. Well. And yeah, um, the rest of my family, their rooms are right down the other end. Yeah. Um, and it was, it, I don't know how long it, it took us, but it was quite far. So it's like three miles. Yeah, it, is a, it was quite a long walk, but it's a massive hotel. So we will walk you around everything that it has on offer. Um, but obviously we'll do that from tomorrow. So we will. Sorry, just to say, yeah. we haven't been all inclusive for years. Nah. We, no, we haven't. don't usually do all inclusive, so this is quite new to us. I'm, I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. Gonna yeah, get bloated. Yeah, I might get a little bit bloated. <laughs> but yeah, look, we're here. We're going to enjoy it. Make the most of it. It's great. It's great quality time with the family, and that's yeah, the main thing. Yeah. So, you know, if we overeat or if we overdrink, it is what it is. You know, we're here to enjoy ourselves, so we'll definitely, we'll definitely do that. Yeah, we'll end so, it here. I've yep. got to unpack. Yeah, got to unpack. Gonna um, make the t cup of tea. I'm gonna make a cup of tea, tea and boy. then uh, we'll pick this up. In the morning. Good morning from Malta. Good morning. Yeah, it's a lovely view out here this morning. Obviously, you've just seen that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, real nice view. We obviously couldn't see it last night when we got here. It was obviously too dark, yeah. but uh, it's a lovely view, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. Yeah, had a really good sleep, actually. Yeah, we did. I think we were obviously shattered, oh, you know. so tired. Travel days, they do we, we, do catch yeah. up. Yeah, we didn't end up going to sleep until, I think it was about midnight, so yeah, that's yeah. very late. Yeah, it is, yeah. Obviously midnight here is then 11 o'clock back at home. Um, and even that would be late, so I think the, uh, the <laughs> travel... early birds. <laughs> yeah, I think this, the travel certainly has caught up with us. Even though we're used to travelling, like we've we've been obviously to America recently, yeah, into New York and Orlando. Uh, and if you haven't watched them vlogs, head back and watch them, yeah, because uh, they were good fun. <laughs> but uh, even with the travel, then for some reason, I've, I've, I've really struggled with this one. But hey, it's another day, so we are going to head down to breakfast now. Yeah, the breakfast uh, is on from seven thirty to I think it was. 10 something like that and it's now currently uh, about quarter past eight so we're gonna head down there now and we'll show you over the breakfast buffet spread so i'm just going to start off here at the coffee station so as you can see you've got these machines that you can select your coffees you've got espresso cappuccino macchiato americano so quite a few there white coffee as you come over here, you do have some juices as well. Pineapple juice, apple juice. So over at the cooked breakfast, over here we have some turkey sausages. We also have some pork sausages. And then moving down a little bit more, we do have some grilled tomatoes and we have some bacon. You've got some hard boiled eggs in here, some baked beans. And then a little bit further down, we do have some scrambled eggs. We have some scrambled eggs with salmon in here, scrambled eggs. And then we do have some fried eggs over here as well. And as you can see behind here, the lady is making them fresh as well. We are meant to have some waffles in here. There isn't any in there now, but they're meant to have waffles in there. And then we do have some potatoes over here too. So we've got a nice range of cakes here. We do have a chocolate cake right in here, uh, some plain cake and some other little treats. We've got some croissants and some pea cakes here. And around the opposite side to the pastries, you do have some yogurts and we do have some fruit as well. Got some apples down there. So yeah, some watermelon, some grapefruit down here. And then yeah, a fruit salad, some bananas, some more apples, oranges, kiwis. So yeah, quite a, a wide range of fruits to select from. And over here as well, we do have some cereals to choose from. Quite a wide range of cereals over here. And then over here we do have the toaster as well and a few selections when it comes to your bread. 
So we do have some lighter options over here. We have got some tomatoes, cucumbers, peppers. We have got some feta cheese over here as well. So around here as well, we do have a selection of hams. Got some olives down here, some capers, some tuna mayo, you can see. So yeah, quite a wide range of selections of hams and some more down here. All done with breakfast? Yeah, that was nice. Yeah, it was okay. Yeah. I must admit, um, I don't want to sound sort of negative or anything like that. Um, but it, it was okay. It's quite a small selection Yeah. for the size of the hotel and how many people were in there. Yeah. That's my opinion. Yeah. Um, but you find something to eat. Like there was, there was, there, there was, was plenty was, there. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, I ended up having like the eggs um, and they were all right. I had yeah. some tomatoes. They were nice. Uh, the sausages were not the best, but you know, it, it, I could choose something else tomorrow. It might be fantastic. So we're here for a week. Nice. So yeah, that was really nice. That yeah. That was really fresh. That was but, nice. Yeah, there's quite a wide range of fruit selection and that was actually all right as well. So, yeah, what we've done now is we've come out of the hotel. We've just come down to the front, so you might be able to work it out behind us. The sea is um, behind us. Yeah, and we've all the family. So we're actually going to head down sort of behind away from the hotel. So we're going to head down that way and just, you know, take a bit. There's a few of the sights in. Yeah, so, guess yeah, we're going to... Guess what we're passing? Yeah, if you can hear us, there's a massive bus going past us. Yeah, sorry, us. it's very noisy on this road. We've actually got a Starbucks. Super close to the hotel, so we can't avoid it, can we? <laughs> but yeah, we're going to walk down sort of the front here, I would say along the beach, but there is no beach, and uh, take in a few of the sites. And then if we stop off and do anything, obviously we'll show you exactly what we do. So we're coming to the Malta Chocolate Factory, as you can see here. They've got a dark chocolate motorbike. It's pretty cool, isn't it? And over here we've got a designer chocolate handbag. So some quite cool things in here. A princess shoe made of chocolate and a football made of chocolate. And then over here we do have some nice mousse cakes. Coconut passion fruit, white chocolate mousse cake. That looks very, very nice. Cherry white chocolate cheesecake and a few other ones. Got banana and chocolate chip muffin here, which looks, which looks amazing. But yeah, a nice wide range of sweet treats in here. And some truffles over here, looking really nice, really nice. We've got some milk chocolate Rocky Road pieces here as well. Yeah, it's a really nice little chocolate place here. So if you're ever in Malta and St Paul's, come over to here. There's a nice range of chocolate you can select from. So we're back at the room now. Yeah, had a nice little uh, stroll for a little bit, didn't we? For yeah. An hour or so it was nice. We didn't actually video much. Obviously, we went into that chocolate shop. Um, oh, but yeah, that all, looked good. All we done really was just have a wonder for an hour or so, um, just looking at some of the sights. We did stop for a drink actually. Yeah. Uh, all the family. We nice. all did stop for a quick drink but we have head back to the hotel now. I've just got to do some work and then we are going to head down for lunch. I think lunch is... Yeah, I think 12.30. Uh, 12.30 and 2.30 and it's now 12 o'clock, so I'm going to do a little bit of work and then we are going to head down there. I think, yeah, I think the others are going to head down by the pool for a bit, so yeah. I might go and join them, but yeah. um, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. I'll get, get the work sorted first go and get some lunch and then we'll probably go down the pool. If we go down to the pool, we won't video anything no. around there. And then what we'll do after then is we'll come up with something that we're gonna do. And then if we can bring you guys along, yeah. obviously we will. Well, there's, like, it's quite warm, but it is cloudy today. Yeah. Um, so we'll yeah. see. Yeah, we'll see. Kids are desperate to go in the pool, so. <laughs> yeah, of course they are. And so am I. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got to get go my, <laughs> Gotta get my swimmers on. So you do see us now, a few hours later. We uh, we did go into the lunch. Yeah, we did go into the lunch um, food sort of court area um, at lunchtime. And we did leave the camera in the room. So we started eating and then we realized we left this in the room. So we, we still have got six other days to show you the lunch. So. We were quite late for the lunch though. Yeah. So we had the last 20 minutes, we didn't realize it shut. Yeah. Well, we knew it, 
We were just cutting we it We thought it was half two, it was actually two. Mm. So we cut it really fine. So we only had the last 20 minutes of lunch. So yeah. there wasn't actually... There wasn't enough time to come up here and get this. And no, stuff, so. there wasn't really a lot to show either. Nah, and so we will show you it on other days. Like I say, this is our first full day. So we've got plenty of time to show you the lunches. Uh, we've just got all doled up, as you can see. We're looking yeah. all nice and fresh. Look a bit different uh, earlier. In between the last clip and now, we did go to the pool. Uh, we went down to, they have got an indoor pool. We did go in there just because of the kids, you know, it's a lot warmer yeah, to go in there. And the weather is not th the best at the minute, I would say. It's quite I cloudy mean, today. It's warm, but it's yeah. cloudy. And when you, and that pool outside is absolutely freezing. Yeah, so yeah, it certainly was. Once you're in it, it weren't too bad. But um, it, it, yeah, it still wasn't wasn't the best. So we went into the indoor pool with the kids, had some fun with those, and uh, yeah, it was it was great great times. You know, it's great to obviously make these memories with the kids and stuff. So yeah, we've done that. So since then, we've come back to the room. We've just got changed now, and we are going to head down for dinner. So our dinner schedule is about half six. So it's in about um, so three or four minutes yeah, time. Yeah, there's a couple of restaurants. The buffet, obviously, which we've been in. Yeah. You can also go to a restaurant that you can book. So we mm. are going to go to the booked restaurant tonight. Yeah, which we've that one nice yeah. as a change yeah we booked that one all 12 of us have booked in there so <laughs> but we haven't actually shown you the other uh, the buffet restaurant yet so no, we will show you that on this trip uh, the only thing you would have seen food related wise would have been the breakfast so yeah, you've seen the breakfast so you'll see this booked restaurant tonight this restaurant tonight is not a buffet you just choose well i think you just, think choose, you just choose your food but it's included in our all, all inclusive yeah it's all so. included so we will choose well we'll show you the menu and we will choose off there and show you what we get uh, and let you know what it's like and then after then we said we might go for a couple of drinks so we're not too sure yet we'll just see we'll see how the family are see how the kids are yeah and then go from there and There's then no pressure do what do you go with the flow yeah yeah we'll go with the flow you'll catch us next when you next see us down at dinner no you won't I'm doing an outfit of the day. Are oh, you going to do an outfit? Outfit of the night. Outfit, outfit of, of the, the night. night. Something a little bit different. <laughs> so we'll be doing that and then we're going to dinner. <laughs> Just quickly before we go for dinner, I'm here with the outfit of the night. We love it, don't we? Well, I do anyway. So I am wearing um, an Oasis dress. Unusual for me. Don't usually do dresses, but I saw this sponsored on instagram <laughs> clearly i'm a sucker for an advert <laughs> and i really liked it but actually it fits really nice and it's got like tie sleeves zip at the back and i've just paired it with my chloe sliders and my hair shoved back into an egghead so we're gonna go down for dinner so we will catch you there So the restaurant is called Cafe de Los, it is a bar and bistro and inside the menu we have got fresh bakery and wraps, so there's quite a few there to choose from. We've got some soups, health watchers corner as well, some nice salad. We've got a pasta and risotto area as well and then these are all the pizzas that are on offer so yeah a wide range of pizzas as well some house specials which sound great and then a nice range of options for the kids as well which is nice and then we have a few options on the grill so that is lovely a few nice options there yeah so got a nice view here as well you can see lovely views from here and they've got a little view of the pool as well so yeah we're gonna choose something off the menu here and let you know what we get and let you know how it is so the food has arrived i have gone for the chicken curry and it looks absolutely lovely and jess you've gone for pizza parma yeah so that looks really good as well my brother has gone for what burger was this Delos burger which looks amazing as well so we're all gonna jump into this everyone's got all their food and then we'll let you know how it is so we're all done with the dinner obviously I didn't choose this I had the chicken curry and that was absolutely lovely however my niece was uh, struggling to eat her chicken breast something uh, so I said I would help her out however it is very very dry uh, the brother polished off his burger pretty much Jess polished off your pizza pretty much and that was all right nice. yeah that was all right wasn't I it that, yeah. yeah really good so yeah not a bad dinner that one so we'll let you know what we get up to after this 
So in the restaurant tonight, we can actually have a dessert as well. So these are the options we have here. I'm not too sure what I'm gonna go for yet. But yeah, we've got some chocolate cake, carrot cake, orange cheesecake, raspberry cheesecake. So yeah, quite a lot to choose from. So we're all sorted in that restaurant now. We are now walking down outside the hotel, kind of along the front to a place called Fat Harry's. So like we said in the restaurant, the food was actually really nice. My niece couldn't actually finish her chicken breast. Uh, so I finished it, it was quite dry though. But my other niece, Lily here, she had the pasta, was it? Yeah, chicken yeah. pasta. Chicken pasta, it was all right, wasn't it? Yeah, it was quite filling, but I liked it. Yeah, quite yeah. filling, but she enjoyed it. So we're gonna head down there here now, straight ahead pretty much, to a place called Fat Harry's, and we'll show you what it's like when we're there. They're having a competition to see who can get it between the harp and the uh, top of the Guinness. So, go. <laughs> that is Tom's. That's actually very good, Tom. Yours is shocking, Darren. Yours is right at the Guinness. That's the same, but either way. No, they're not! Yeah. Yours is better, Tom's is better. Yeah, Tom's wife. So we're all done at Fat Harry's. We had a bit of fun. This is actually Harry here. Isn't your bar though, is it Harry? No. Nah, it's definitely not. But yeah, that was alright. And then we had a few drinks with the family. So we're now heading back to the hotel. We're gonna get back there, just chill out for a bit. And we'll pick this up in the morning. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. 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 Morning guys. Morning from day three. Day three. Day yeah. three in Malta. Yeah, day three in Malta. Not much planned today like yesterday really is there? No, I think we are it's what is the time? But we have got it's things quarter planned. To nine. It's yeah. quarter to nine. I think we're gonna go down for breakfast with the family. Yeah. And then we'll probably formulate a plan from there and see what everyone yeah. fancies. Um, it's one of them holidays, this today. one, where it's completely different to what we normally do. Yeah. Normally we've we're got a bit of an itinerary. We have got things planned and we will do these things. Um, but everything seems to be planned sort of later on in holiday. So yeah. yeah, for the first couple of days, it's more just finding our feet and finding you know uh, the location, finding what's what. Uh, a few bars and stuff around here like we have done uh, and then sort of going from there but I'm gonna head down for breakfast now I think we are going to go maybe for a longer walk later yeah on. maybe uh, yeah. maybe maybe just you and me will go yeah because uh, obviously with all the family and stuff like that it's um it's just it's, yeah it's, like it's, it's, it, by the pool, yeah they? exactly they don't want to go for big <laughs> walks which is fair enough uh, I have actually purchased a drone so if I can fly the drone up and show you some of the views around the bay I will do that mm. um, I just need to make sure that it's actually legal to do that first <laughs> As I don't, don't want, want to, to be, arrested. yeah, I don't want to be arrested <laughs> in Mulwa. So uh, yeah, we're gonna head down for breakfast now. Obviously, we're not gonna show you over the breakfast because we have done that, but we will plan on showing you over probably the dinner buffet tonight because we yeah. we won't go into the same restaurant as last night. We won't go in that one tonight. No. I should imagine anyway. I think anyway, we'll probably go to the buffet, but yeah, we'll see. Yeah, we'll update you. Yeah, when yeah. we know what we're doing, gonna be doing today. Yeah, we'll update you. Yeah, and then we'll go from there. So breakfast is all done. Yeah, it's quite a lot later actually. It's uh, ten to eleven, but we've. Um, yeah. Sorry, I'm talking quite quietly because we're just walking through the hallway. Yeah. Um, we have been just trying to work out what we're going to do today, but the plan is we're going to get an Uber yep. to Valletta, which is the capital. Yep. Um, of Malta, so we're going to go there with Tom's mum and dad. Yeah. Rachel, Darren, and the kids are probably just going to chill by the pool. Yeah, with um, all the kids now, it's quite yeah. a long day with kids, yeah. so it's it's nice for them to. Just chill out here, really. So, yeah, we're going to head down there now. We're just walking to mum and dad's. Them, yeah, so we're just walking down to mum and dad's room now. Then we're going to go out the front of the hotel and grab an Uber. Uh, I'm not sure how long it takes to get there. 
think it says on my map it's about 37 minutes, so probably about yeah. half hour. Which yeah, so we'll head bad. there. So we're going to bring you guys along for the first day out exploring. Yeah, I'm excited. We have actually booked a um, open top bus uh, excursion, but it's yeah. a flexible ticket, so you can go whenever. Um, so once you activate it, you can then, I think you get 24 hours, do yeah. you? I think it's 24 hours, yeah. So, so once we activate that, which we will probably do in the next few days, a couple yeah, of days, yeah. we probably won't do it tomorrow because tomorrow is actually my little nephew's birthday. Our nephew. Oh, our nephew, yeah, sorry. So, um, <laughs> yeah, so it's his birthday, so we'll, we'll celebrate with him. Yeah, so we're be with whether him we tomorrow. do too much or tomorrow, we're not too sure. We'll just obviously play it by ear. Um, but the, the priority with that is obviously spend it with him yeah. as it's his birthday. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do that tomorrow. But for today, like we say, we're going to bring you guys along to, to Valletta. Valletta. So we're in with the OOTD. Only because we're going out for the day, so I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing. So I've got my Adidas trainers, um, Adenola shorts, same as my uh, leggings that I wore to travel in, like the crossover, they're so comfy. And then I'm wearing this Vans t-shirt, which is actually men's, but oversized. Yeah, you love your oversized Sunglasses. stuff, don't you? Yeah. Good to go. Good to go. So these are the views from mum and dad and Joe's room. Over here actually, if I zoom in, is our balcony. One of those anyway. Well, it's the same floor, so yeah, just in there. That is our balcony. And then the views, if I just zoom back out, these are the views that they've got. So last night is essentially, we walked down to Fat Harry's. That is just down here. So there's a couple of other nice restaurants down there which we might actually visit. I know we are all inclusive, but it's obviously nice to break it up and come out of the hotel. So if we do do that, obviously we'll let you know. But for now, we're off to Valletta. We have made it to Valletta. Yep. That we, um, Uber didn't take long, about half an hour. Nah, and he's dropped us off at St George's Square. Yeah, so we're right. So yeah, here. right in like the heart of it. So we're gonna have a look around here, obviously take a few clips. We probably will stop for a coffee or a drink or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're gonna grab some um, some clips of, of the views. Let's have a look around. There is a city bus tour that you can do that we've seen that yeah. looks quite good. So we might actually do that. We'll check, there's a board over there. We'll go look at it. We'll go look at the prices and see if it's yeah. in something that we want to do. Yeah, that's it, everybody's got it. So we're gonna take it in, get some clips, and then show you what we do.
So we have come to this little stand outside the upper Baraka Gardens, I think it is. It's just in there, we've come out. And this gentleman here can make us, or Jess, a necklace with her name on. So she's gonna get one and we'll show you what he does. Perfect, lovely, thank you. All done with the jewellery for Jess. Now it looks quite nice that. We'll show you a bit more up close once we are once we're back at what she actually got. But yeah, nice little find that. So we've had a little stroll down uh, around some of the sites now. We've actually just stopped for some lunch. So I can't remember what the place is called. We'll find we'll find the name and let you know. But uh, we're gonna grab some food here, grab a quick drink and then continue with our day. There is a war museum just around the corner from here, so we are gonna head round there once we are fed. And then I'm not sure what our plan is after then. We might do a few other things, but obviously we'll bring you along and show you exactly what we do do. But it's an amazing sights around here, absolutely fantastic. If you've never been here, definitely come along because uh, yeah, it is, a, it is an amazing place. So this is the necklace <laughs> that you have made. Looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, it's so cute. Yeah, no. It's so cute. No, it is nice. So we're just going to wait here now. We've got a couple of coffees and cokes and waiting for our food. We'll let you know what we get. So I have gone for the crispy chicken salad, keeping it quite healthy today. And then Jess has got over here, well Jess has actually started hers, but we're going to look at uh, my mum's. So what, what's this called? It's a Maltese fritter. Fritter? Something like that, yeah. But it looks amazing, so yeah, it does look great. So we'll let you know how these are on our little pit stop. All done with lunch. That was amazing. Oh, it was so nice. Yeah, it was really refreshing. I know, don't come at me in the comments for how I um, pronounced my lunch. Yeah, I, I can't. And I still I don't, don't know. know. how you say it. Maltese frit fritter? Still don't know. Don't know. Anyway, no, I'm not even going to try. I'm not even going to try and attempt to say it because we can't. <laughs> no. Um, but we've now come to the, um, we've come to Fort St. Elmo and this is where the National War Museum is. So yeah. we've um, got tickets. Yep. Um, so we're going to go in there. <laughs> Four, yeah, four adults was 10 euros each, the, so 40 yeah, euros. 40 euros for the... Uh, yeah, so we're going to head... Uh, it's literally just around the corner from where we've just eaten. I think it's so. in there. And it's basically just yeah. here, yeah. Yeah, so um, That's what I meant, sorry. Oh, sorry, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You come down the hill and it's here. Yeah, so, yeah. so it's perfect. So we're going to head in there now, show you what it's all about. And then after them, we're not too sure what we're going to do. Obviously, we'll play no, it by ear. It's getting on yeah, a little bit now. Yeah. It's 20 past two now, so yeah. it's half an hour drive back to the hotel. Yeah. We've also got to try and get an Uber, and I don't know where the easiest yeah. place to get an Uber would be. And then also, yeah, we, we will probably go to dinner relatively early because of the kids as well, yeah. they're young. Yeah. So, yeah, we'll, we'll sort that out once we're done in here, but we'll show you what it's all about.
done with the war museum yeah that was very interesting yeah it I was i thoroughly enjoyed that yeah it was 10 out um, of 10 yeah it was good very in-depth you know if you're not that well educated in certain aspects of it all yeah no it was really you know, there was really a lot of um there's a lot of information in there obviously you'll see the clips and stuff quite so. a long tour but well quite a long museum tour but yeah. um yeah i really enjoyed it yeah, I suppose it's one of the ones where you make it as long as you want. It's yeah. obviously with, with all the stuff to read and go through. If you want to read um, every single little detail like yeah, I of course. do, yeah, it goes. I love history. Yeah, you go right in depth <laughs> with it then you, but no, nah, it was fantastic. Glad we've done it. And obviously, it's nice to, to come away from the hotel, do a few things yeah. touristy. Uh, but the plan now is to head back to the hotel. Yep. So we're, we're going to jump. our way back, I think. Yeah, we're going to jump yeah. in an Uber it's and then we're going to head back. Quarter to four now, so it's half yep. an hour back to the hotel, so... Get back, get ourselves set. We yeah. might, we might chill out. Might go by the pool, do do a few bits and bobs, You've and then we will, yeah, you, a little bit so. of work, and then head out for dinner. So we're well, not out for dinner, but go down to the buffet. Mm. I'm sure that's what we're doing tonight. But yeah. whatever we do, do we will show you because we haven't shown you the buffet yet. So we will show you through all what's on offer. So you catch us uh, quite a lot later. We got back from Valletta and we just chilled by the pool. I chilled by the pool and Tom did some work. It's now about five past seven and Tom's just getting ready for dinner. I'm ready first, can you believe it? So I thought I'd just do outfit of the night. Two in one day, can you believe it? So I have got my um, t-shirt on from sister seekers i think it is um and then i've got some shorts uh, like a skirt sorry from river island and then just some um sandals washed my hair gonna go down to the buffet tonight so i think we'll probably take the camera see how busy it is and i'm sure tom will um show you the food catch you at dinner so we are down at the dinner buffet tonight. Obviously the restaurant we were in last night was the other one in the hotel. That was more of a set menu that you choose from. But now we are at the buffet. So what I'll do here is just walk you through everything that is on offer. So as you can see, we do have some chef's pasta of the day, along with some creamy mushroom rice, or risotto, sorry. Next to it, we do have some vegetarian pizza, is what it says. There isn't much of it left, but we do have that here. And then we do have some roast new potatoes here. Also with some braised beef and mushrooms, rosemary, and some sauce. Looking really good. And then over here we do have some chicken drumsticks. These are rosemary and lemon flavored, followed by some peas. And then there is some steamed fish that they've just taken away that was here. If I can get a clip of it, I will do. So we do have some grilled pork over here as well. We do have some soup options over here. We have a roast plum, tomato, and pesto soup, which I did see someone walk by with it. It looked really good. And then we do have a chef soup of the day as well. So a couple of options when it comes to choosing your soup. And just like breakfast as well, you have all your fruit options down here. Your apples, oranges, mixed fruit, kiwi. We do have a pistachio gatto here as well, which looks really good. And then some other desserts over here, as you can see, apricot almond tart. My, my wife had that yesterday, and it was actually really nice. And then some other ones that you see over here, really nice. So over here as well, you do have some salad options. If you want to go for something quite light, you've obviously got your mixed salad, you've got your peppers, leaves, cucumber, tomatoes. And then over here, there's some tuna pumpkin salad here, which looks quite nice. So a few other lighter options. So we are all finished with dinner. That was delicious. Yeah, it was nice to get yeah, on board. It was nice. Obviously with a buffet, you can have as much as you want, can't you? So yeah. we had a couple of plates, yeah. but saving myself for a couple of drinks in the bar. So yeah. that's what we're going to do now. We're going to go just to the hotel bar, um, have a couple of drinks and probably call it a night. It's uh, yeah. 20 to nine now. So mm. yeah, we're going to yeah. end this particular vlog now yeah so whether this goes we'll again into <laughs> yeah whether it goes into two or three vlogs we're still not yeah. sure so we're just going to go with the flow go with the flow see what content we've got and then put it all together yeah and whether that splits into one or two or three vlogs or four we'll see, we'll see. for tonight we're going to call it that we're going to end it here yep and then we're going to pick it up again pick you up tomorrow in the morning when mm. it's my nephew's birthday yeah so yeah we'll see you then see you then bye bye